might as well just give up, Aiden. Okay? This date is going on. Period. Coming! Oh, good one, Aiden. Okay, you got me. Now, open the door. So if you have a spirit attached to you, do you get to have a normal life? And Jody tries to do that in this uh, episode and doesn't work out too well. So, hope you enjoy the video. If you do, hit the like button down below and uh, leave a comment if you would. And uh, if you haven't watched the beginning of the series, go back and watch all the other ones. And uh, if you like it, like anything on this channel, go ahead and and hit that subscribe button and ring the bell and uh, I got more coming I hope you enjoy this video so enough of this uh, get to watching thanks mm, later Yeah? Jody. Hey, it's, it's Ryan. Ryan! I was just wondering if you got my email. What, what, wait, what, what email? The one I sent three days ago. You know, I've, I've actually been having problems with my computer. What, what was the email about? Dinner, tonight, fancy restaurant. <laughs> anyway, it, it's too late now, so... Maybe another time? Shit. Shit, I'm so sorry. I... You know, why, why don't you just come over here for dinner tonight? I mean, you wanted to see my apartment anyway, so... Um, uh, sure, but I... How about around eight? Okay. Yeah, I'll, I'll bring a kick-ass bottle of wine. See you later. Now I get why you blasted my computer. You didn't want me to see Ryan. It's not your call, Aiden. I can do what I want. Fuck this. Fuck this! We're not gonna start this again! I'm not yours, Aiden! I can have a relationship with whoever I want. This is my life. Oh, do you fucking hear me? This is my life! You know what? I happen to think Ryan is great. He's charming, he's intelligent, he's funny. And I think I'm falling for him. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm aware of what happened at the bar. Fuck you for reminding me. Ryan is not like that. Okay. Okay. It's seven o'clock. I have an hour to make dinner, tidy up, and make myself look good.
books. Okay, on the bookshelf. Okay, great. The trash can in the kitchen. You know, you're wasting your time, Aiden. You're not gonna stop me from seeing Ryan. Oh my God. Oh my God, the dinner. Okay, there's, there's gotta be something in the kitchen. I gotta find something I can make in one hour with what's ever left in the fridge. Asian beef, oh. I mean, that looks good. It's not too complicated. Curried chicken with oven-baked vegetables. It'll take some time in the oven, but it seems doable. Pizza delivery. I mean, it's not exactly gourmet, but it, it, no preparation, no mess, I mean, it could be an option. Yeah. Asian beef. I mean, it looks suitably exotic. <laughs> as long as I don't manage to fuck it up. Thanks, Aiden. So far, so good. Use a walk. He's early. I'm coming. I 
I haven't finished cooking. Jeez, I better go crap. Do I have time to take a shower first? Oh, what should I wear? Oh, hi, Ryan. I've been waiting for you. Hot. He is gonna see a whole new side of me. You might as well just give up, Aiden. Okay? This date is going on. Period. Coming! Oh, good one, Aiden. Okay, you got me. Now, open the door. Aiden! Aiden, come on, open up! play too. Ginger. It's supposed to be an aphrodisiac. I mean, it's not in the recipe, but... Come on, you don't need that. All right, add the sake for flavor. I think I'm beginning to like cooking. Ryan, you are gonna love this.
Oh, huh. Yeah, that's very funny, Aiden. Wow, it's very romantic. <laughs> Aiden, don't be a pain in the ass. I didn't behave yourself. This is important to me, and I'm counting on you. I... <laughs> <laughs> uh, Chateau Margot, 2001. The guy in the store said it was a pretty good year. That sounds good to me, so... <laughs> Sorry about the mess. I mean, I just moved in, so that's... No, no problem. Looks lived in. <laughs> Why don't you sit? Um, I'll get the, um... the thing that opens the wine. <laughs> ah! Cool apartment! Huh? Yeah, thanks! For fuck's sakes!
You want me to open it? No, no, I'll do it. <laughs> to your new apartment. To my new apartment. Wow, oh, so when did you move in? Um, a couple weeks ago. Yeah, the agency found it for me and all furnished and everything. And how about you? Where where do you live? Oh, I uh, have a place just outside of town. And did you did you grow up here? No, no, I, I was born in Oregon. Yeah, my parents and brothers still live there. But I, I moved out when I was 16. 16? out or something? It, it's nothing. It's just... Aiden's messing with us. Ignore him. Ignore him. You know, I'm gonna go check on the dinner because this cooking thing, it's a whole new adventure for me. <laughs> you need help? No, but why don't you go sit and more wine would be nice. <laughs> okay. Ah, Asian beef, right? Yeah. No, I was sent to China for a year. I love Asian food. Oh, well, do not get your hopes up because this is probably the second time that I've cooked and I would rather not talk about the first time. Mm, good. Good. I'm, I'm glad. I'm glad you like it. So we've been working together now for what, like two years? I mean, almost nothing about you. Mm. Yeah, your parents, do you, uh, still see them? Sure everything's okay? Yes, everything's fine. Aiden is just... He's just feeling a little nervous. It's okay, really. Yeah. Did, did Nathan ever manage to explain to you why you have this link with Aiden? No. I mean, not really. I mean, they learn... I think there's something wrong with Aiden. Give me a second. I'm fed up with you and your goddamn jealousy. So why don't you just go back to whatever ethereal fucking place you came from and let me get on with my life? Get out of here! Do you fucking hear me? Get the fuck out! Yeah, he never leaves me. Stop. What a... Uh, Aiden's not happy with me being I don't give a damn how Aiden feels. And are you, um... I need you to just stop! Listen, I... 
I better go. No, no, Ryan, wait. No, Jody, look, I, <laughs> Iden's very possessive. I, I think you gotta work it out with him. Jody, look, I, we need to rush it. Okay, let's just take some time to get to know each other. Maybe Iden will end up being okay with that. You happy now? You get what you wanted. He's gone, and now you have me to yourself. I really hope you're deliriously fucking happy. Why don't you just float around in your invisible world and watch me cry? I hate you! Do you hear me? I fucking hate you! <laughs> <laughs>